we came up with this tabless architecture that maybe you've heard about um, that, that basically removes the thermal problem from the equation and allows us to go to the absolute lowest cost form factor um, and the simplest manufacturing process. And this is what, this is what we mean when we, when we talk about tabless. It's kind of a beautiful thing. Uh, that's what these that's what these t-shirts mean but it's very esoteric it's like nobody could figure it out but yeah um, we basically took the existing foils laser patterned them and enabled dozens of connections into the active material through this shingled spiral you can see with simpler manufacturing fewer parts 50 50 millimeter versus 250 millimeter electrical path length uh, which is how we get all the thermal benefits yeah this is important to appreciate like basically the the, the, the distance that that electron has to travel, you know, it's, it's just much less. Um, so uh, you actually have a shorter path length in a large tabless, a large tabless cell than you have in the smaller cell with tabs. So this is a big deal. So even though the, the cell is bigger, it actually has uh, more power. Uh, the power to weight ratio is actually better than the smaller cell with, with, with tabs. This is, uh, you know, again, like, this is quite, quite hard to do. It, so it's... Uh, you know, nobody's done it before, um, so, uh, and it really took a, a tremendous amount of effort uh, w within Tesla engineering to figure out how do we make a freaking tabless cell um, and have it actually work and, and then connect that to the top cap. And it's, uh, there's a whole bunch of things that we're, you know, keeping a little secret source here that we're not telling everything. Um, <laughs> but uh, Sometimes what's <laughs> elegant and simple is still hard, and it, we, we, it took us a lot of trials, but we're, we're happy where we ended up. Yeah, I mean everything's simple in, in recollection. You know, after you like uh, simple, everything. It's hard until it's discovered, and then it's simple. <laughs> um, so anyway, but it's, there's a there's a lot of really cool things going on uh, that that enable uh, tabless, and um, uh, it's really you know due to a really great engineering team, Drew and the and the rest of the team have done amazing work in, in achieving this uh, tabless construction. Um, and it sounds, I think it may sort of sound a bit silly to some people, but <laughs> this was, this is like, if for people that really know cells, this is a massive breakthrough. For cylindricals to be able to, to get rid of the tabs dramatically simplifies winding and coating. Yeah. And has an awesome thermal and performance benefit. Yeah, um, that's a, just to be so, elaborate on that a bit, it's like when the cell is, is going, going through the, 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 system, the system, it it has to keep stopping where all the tabs are. Yes. So you can't do... A you can't do continuous motion uh, uh, production uh, if you have tabs. You have to keep stopping, and, and then there's a rate at which you can start and stop and accelerate again, and and really slows down the the rate of production. And then sometimes you get the tabs wrong, um, and you also get lose a little bit of, of of active area. It's 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 really a huge pain in the ass to have tabs um, yes. from a production standpoint. Yes. Um, and so when we put it all together and go to our new 80 millimeter length, 4680 we call this uh, new cell design, we get five times the energy with six times the power and enable 16% range increase, just form factor alone. Uh, yeah, so when, when, these, <laughs> yeah, it's pretty great. And just, just to, to clarify, that when we see these um, plus 16% six, or whatever the, the percentage range increases, these are the amounts due just to that particular innovation. Yes. So we'll list a whole bunch of innovations, and then when you add them up, you get a total uh, improvement in uh, energy density and cost. Uh, but uh, th these numbers are, are what refer to just this thing. Yeah, and I want to stress, this is not just a concept or a rendering. We are starting to ramp up manufacturing of these cells at our pilot 10 gigawatt hour production facility just around the corner. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a video of uh, some of what's going on in the plant. Um, now, I mean, to be clear, it will take about a year to reach the 10 gigawatt hour capacity.